Hey everyone, Joe Lancer, and today we are in North Providence, yes, North Providence, going for my first food challenge win in Rhode Island. So today we are outside Camp Nowhere, yes, Camp Nowhere, but today this really is somewhere to be. So today we're going to do an absolutely massive slider challenge. In fact, this is an all-you-can-eat slider challenge. We are here to set the slider record, and I will say they are not like, you know, E5 or 10. They want me to go big, 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 so we're going to see what we can do. So the restaurant itself here specializes in kind of sliders, and then all kinds of really cool mixed drinks. So they have like these big fish bowls that just bubble and smoke and steam. Then with the sliders we have everything from beef, we have chicken, we have eggplant, we have short ribs. It is it's absolutely super awesome. This place itself is freaking awesome. For $3.75 you can get two sliders. Yes, two sliders. And all the drinks are $3.75 as well. So super for like affordable, a really cool place to come on by. I love the look of this place. On the inside it looks like a lodge, like a camp. So it's super, super awesome. So for the sliders I do get to pick all my flavors. I'm just going to kind of order a variety um, and kind of go from there. But they have like ones that are, you know, resemble little Big Macs. They have ones that have like barbecue on them. And of course like short ribs. How can you go wrong? So anyway, let's head on in. Let's have some fun, let's eat some food. Yes, I have a little band-aid. I cut part of my finger off the other day, long story short. But anyway, so yeah, this will be super awesome. Um, don't know how many we'll eat. I don't care. This is gonna be so delicious. Let's have some fun. It smells great, and uh, so let's head on in and let's eat some food. All right, so here at the start of our sliders. We actually do have uh, 30 in front of us to start. Um, they have a very expansive menu, but I did try one of each, and then I kind of got a couple more going from there. So, we have the original beef slider, which is basically just like a little cheeseburger. We have the original beef and cheese, very traditional. We have a buffalo chicken slider, so we're talking nice little fried chicken with buffalo sauce on it. We have the rodeo slider, which has crispy fried onions, beef patty, and a lovely barbecue sauce. We have the eggplant slider, which has a fried eggplant and a marinara sauce. We have the cluck cluck slider, which has a Cajun uh, actual uh, mayo on it, and then of course a fried chicken, and then additionally we have the chicken parm slider which again you have your cheese your marinara sauce so it's like a chicken parm we have the big mac mini and then finally we also have the short rib slider which sounds absolutely delicious guys we're talking short ribs crispy fried onions and of course some delicious sauce on that so that's pretty much about it as many sliders as we can eat so we'll get started with these we can always order more and uh at that let's pretty much get started let's have some fun seeds food i'm pumped and by the way do you see this freaking drink just bubbling and smoking this is one of their fish bowls really cool Look, even a little freaking rubber ducky on it. So this is an awesome place. I get it, guys. I'm just absolutely pumped. Um, so let's eat some food. All right, so how about we get started? Uh, I do have my phone here. I'll set a timer. Again, there really isn't a time limit, but it is just as many as we can. So I'll start it, let's say, at the 10-second uh, mark. Uh, I don't really know where to start. I'm going to start with this plate. This is literally all of everything on here. So I'll probably start with uh, this one here. I think this is the kind of traditional slider. Anyway, so I'll start 15 the timer. So, how about we get started? Well, it's gonna just basically right now. So, let's eat. Mm. Pickles, beef, actually, that might be one of the Big Mac ones. That's delicious. Buffalo chicken. Nice and juicy. Fried chicken is really good actually. This is definitely the Big Mac one. 
That sauce. Rodeo. Fried onions and barbecue. Eggplant parm. Mm. Woo! Delicious. Nice and saucy. Hey everyone, welcome to this video where today we're here at Camp Nowhere in North Providence, Rhode Island. My first time in Providence, my first time in Rhode Island, and going for my first food challenge win in Rhode Island, the state of Rhode Island, um, which if you're not familiar is a very small state on the eastern United States. Uh, so essentially we had a one sitting time limit, so no time per se, just in one seating, to set a slider record. Um, previously the most that had ever been eaten was 12 in one seating, so we were going to see if we could beat that. Um, I started again with the uh, 30 in front of me, a um, good variety of different sliders. That short rib. Woo! I do eat animals. It's true. And of course, if I want it more, I would just order them as per um, the my request. Um, so the sliders were about three seventy-five for two sliders, just under four dollars, um, which is a super super good deal. They each weighed about a quarter pound or just over a quarter pound, so they're definitely sizable. Great sauces on here, guys. Great little flavors. Perfect little bite. Of course, like nobody needs to eat thirty of these, so great deal. Come by, grab a couple. That's what you need to do. I will say they were absolutely delicious. They had some really unique ones as well, such as like chicken parms. The short rib ones were just like super delicious. All the little Big Mac burger ones I was eating were also super delicious. Um, so yeah, I was definitely really enjoying all the different diverse flavors that they had to offer. <coughs> Went down the wrong windpipe. Don't inhale burgers, just eat them. Big Mac ones, very delicious. We got lots of little rodeo ones. All these weight, we got a quarter pounder just over as well. So we got some serious weight and sliders here. Besides the sliders, the place is also known for their drinks. They had some really cool looking drinks, um, such as that freaking fish bowl I had in front of me there. But then again, the whole like the whole thing with this restaurant is it is just a heck of a deal. It is like great quality food at a great price. When you can get, you know, again, like a couple sliders and a, a drink for under 10 bucks, like that's crazy. All right, getting into some more here. I got a lot of the beef ones. But here we have a couple more of the chicken parm ones, which are very, very, very good. Speaking of all the delicious different kinds of flavors, let me know down below in a comment which one you think would be your favorite. Whether it be, you know, the Big Mac, whether it be the chicken parm, maybe it's an eggplant parm if you're like a vegetarian. Uh, maybe it is the uh, Cajun chicken, the cluck cluck, you know, all the good stuff. I'm trying to see what I the time. For some reason, it is not identifying me. How do you not identify me right now? Anyway, guys, we are just a bit over 10 minutes. Delicious flavors, I love burgers. This is absolutely a treat. I did order a couple more, as you heard. Let's keep on going. Besides that, I think this majority of the information, again, basically we're gonna be eating as many sliders as we can. Definitely, like I said, a lot, a lot of food, 
I don't know how many we'll be able to eat, but of course, let's tune on in, let's see what happens. Maybe I'll hop back in a little bit later, and at that, let's get to the video. This is the time where I start undoing the belt. Okay, it's more room there, guys, extra horsepower. So we finished these. Again, this is just over seven pounds of sliders. I did order 10 more, 40, 40 times quarter pound. Look at that 10 pounds. Another cluck cluck. I really like the sauce on that one. Mm, thank you. You're very welcome. Grab my mind. This will be 27. Woo. Lots of food. Lots of really nice variety. These are all the short rib ones. Which I'll order a few more of because they are very, very good. Mm. Oh man, woo! Those just hit, just hit just right there in the fields, woo! Nice and hot. And we're coming on about 18 minutes in. Gotta give that minute to cool down. Get on these little short rib ones. All right, so we are 34 sliders in, guys. Definitely starting to fill up a bit. Very, very good. The sugar ones are fire. These parmes are fire. All of them have been fantastic so far. Excuse me, comments to the chef. Definitely dive into these ones. The nice thing with the parms, not only do they taste great, but they are nice and juicy. They're really easy to eat and get down. Chicken parm. I can go wrong. I don't know how many I was going to do. I figured maybe I'd be able to do 40. I think I'd probably get a few more in, so order a few more and kind of keep going from there. But this will put us at 10 pounds. And everyone, if you made it to this point in the video, you are really a happy, healthy, hungry family member. Comment down below, hashtag family. Let me know you are still in it because you rock. You are amazing. I hope you know you are a valued person. I love you. I care for you. And you absolutely are amazing. Could I get um, three more of the short rib and three of the cluck cluck? Thanks, man. Order a few more. 
Don't try to be conservative. Woof. On the menu, they also have, and yes, this is a thing, guys, deep fried Twinkies and s'mores. I love s'mores. When you're at camp, s'mores, like the summertime thing, just, that's my jam, so. I don't know how they make the s'mores, but I do want to make sure I have room for a s'more. What's the highest number of sliders you've ever seen somebody eat here? What's that? 38. 38, yeah. 12. So there you go, guys. The most somebody's ever eaten here before is 12. We are now about to be at 38. And there's a disclaimer at the beginning of the video, but just don't do this. Don't try this at home. You don't need to. I'm doing this so you don't have to. This is 40, this will put us at 10 pounds. Whew. Very short food though. So 10 pounds, 40 sliders in. Here we have three of the short rib, three of the cluck cluck, which has a Cajun uh, mayo on it, which is really, really good. So this is 11 and a half pounds. I'll try one or two of these, and if they're still moving, I'll order a couple more. Ah, definitely starting to fill up. Very good though, love the flavors. Having the diversity is really nice as well. Uh, just kind of, you know, keeps things exciting and flavorful. That's, I guess, the benefit of having, you know, the menu with nine different types of sliders and you can just keep on order. Cluck, cluck. See, these are hot. Damn, that's good though. That fried chicken I got here is real fire. Can I get two of the, the Mac Minis? So that would put us at 12 pounds, 48 sliders. Let's see where you can go. Some people say the sky is the limit. I think my abdominal, like my, you know, my abdomen busting out is technically the limit, but. You know, nonetheless. About 32 minutes in, guys. Now 
the restaurant asked me how long I'd eat for. I said probably about 40 minutes. So we are getting close to that. We'll finish these off, hopefully. Maybe we'll get a couple more in, just a couple. Ooh. A lot of food, everybody. Especially when you factor in all the drinks and stuff. So that was 48, 12 pounds of sliders, guys. Here's where we'd be going for, no wait, was that 46? No, I think that was 48. Was that 48? 48. 48, I right, this brings to 50, I think. There you go, I'm glad somebody's keeping track. I'm getting a little food drunk, you know, the food is hitting me, I guess you could say, but, oh man, let's get this done. Lots of minutes into sliders and chill at Camp Nowhere. Specifically, probably about 38 minutes. So this is 50, I think? Correct. Oof. All right, well, this is the moment, guys. Should we try to get a couple more? Or should we get some s'mores, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> All right, well, maybe I'll do, uh, this would be, what we say, 12, like 12 and a half pounds. <sighs> Let's do, uh, Let's try to get, we'll try to get 13, I guess. So we'll go for 52. So how about we do, uh, oh, that's 50. This 50. That's yeah, so if we get two more, it'll be 52, right? Yeah. Let's get, uh, I guess, two more cluck clucks, or one cluck, yeah, two more cluck clucks, and uh, we'll have a s'mores, whatever that looks like. Thank you. There you go, guys. So that's that's where we're about 40 minutes. This is number 50. This is number 50. So thank you, thank you. Everybody here gets dinner and a show today, so you know that's the perk of coming on out. Dinner and a show. Two more coming too, so he's gonna Oof. try to do 52. Yeah. He's got two more and then he's you have dessert after. I mean you gotta try it, you know. You so. try it. I would get 50 desserts. There you go. <laughs> oh. So there is 50. We are about 41 and a half minutes in. Oh, so that's about what I can do in 40 minutes. I ordered the two more, so we'll try to get those done. But I, I'm pretty full, that is for sure. small amount of food. Yeah, preferably not kill myself. 
That guy looks smart. That's pretty cool, actually. Uh, all right. Two more cluck clucks, guys. All right. Uh, yeah. Remember I said, enjoy a couple. You don't need 52. Nobody does. Not even me. Last one for me, guys. Oof. Oof. Oh. Now I'm dying. Oh. Oh. So close. Uh, we're here. We're here. We're here now. We are done. Oh my gosh. Yeah. Ooh, so fifty-two. 13 pounds of sliders, guys. Probably about 45 minutes, 45 seconds, something like that. Woo! I will say, it's a good thing everything was so dang good here at Camp Nowhere. Really enjoyed it. I'd say my favorites probably were the short rib, the cluck cluck, and the mini Big Mac. Very, very good. Just great, great, great flavors. Oh, man. That is a lot of food. Like I said, come on by and buy a couple. Don't eat 52. That's just, it's just too, too, too many. But a uh, huge thanks to everybody here, guys. The staff have been fantastic. Like I said, the food is great. Really cool spot. So if you're ever in Providence, North Providence, East Providence, South Providence, or West Providence, because apparently these are all different towns, or just Providence itself, come up north to North Providence. Grab yourself some items. Really cool spot. Like I said, whether you want a fish bowl, a fancy drink, or some sliders. They got you covered. And even s'mores. So if you want s'more, they got you covered. Let me try a, let me try a s'more. Because, why not? There you go guys, marshmallow, chocolate graham crackers. Actually, oh, so that's pretty damn good. They're pretty damn good. They taste like a Hershey Kiss, the chocolate. Delicious. All right, everyone. Well, with that, I guess that's about it. Hope you enjoyed today's video. And that's it. Just come to Camp Nowhere. Until next time, everybody. Say happy healthy, hungry, happy eating. Check out JoelEats.com. Grab yourself some merch. We really did eat animals today. And until that, have a lovely day. All right, everyone, and we are downtown Providence. Um, here I am, what is called the pedestrian bridge. It is a bridge made for pedestrians and bicycles, believe it or not, over a waterway. It's very, very, very beautiful. Um, I'll show you some of this, and then I'll also show you a view from the side. So as you can see, it's just a big, 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 vast light up bridge. And you get to see all kind of the other areas of downtown. You know, we have an array of larger kind of buildings over there we have obviously the waterways you can see and then all along here we have multiple uh, kind of outlets you know made for sitting and lounging again it is lit up very very nicely as well 
And uh, yeah, so we'll kind of maybe continue down and walk to the other side. And then, like I said, I'll show you from a side view um, where it is definitely uh, quite a beautiful fixture in itself. So this is what it looks like from, you know, the one side of it. And then I'll go show you the other side here in a second. Here is another um, kind of alternate path or an alternate area on the pedestrian bridge. And then it's overlooking, um, I mean, obviously multiple bridges over here. Now these are definitely uh, vehicle functioning, motor vehicle bridges. And here we have what appears to be like either an old factory or an old, you know, something with some big chimney stacks. Um, sign this is the river house. So yeah, pretty, uh, pretty cool down here. Pretty, pretty dang cool. Uh, I'm sure we'll see some more of Providence. Um, but in the meantime, this is nice. I'm impressed. And here's what the pedestrian bridge, you know, actually looks like from the side view. So yeah, pretty cool. There's the moon. Obviously, you know, I mean, the, the camera, admittingly, in this, you know, this dark, this low light, it doesn't quite capture, you know, the full beauty of it. But, uh, but it does not too, too, too bad of a job. Not too, too, too bad of a job. And there's, again, some of the kind of sights over there of uh, all this, what I would call, you know, kind of downtown Providence. Um, but very, very beautiful so far, guys. And I'm, I'm, I'm pretty impressed. Uh, my first time in Rhode Island. And yeah, I'm sure we'll see, like I said, kind of we'll see some more sights. And although obviously by day, I think it will be a little more, you know, a little more uh, meaningful in some capacity. So let's just kind of uh, see what else, see what else we can bring. I will say, you yeah, I'll stop here because we got light. In general, although, you know, I love to, uh, you know, include these kinds of clips and, you know, just kind of showing you places and stuff. Man, I've got to do so little this trip. It's been so busy, so much time on the road, um, like so much driving. And then if I'm not driving, I'm either at the gym or trying to do some work or stuff. So it's kind of nice to actually finally get out, kind of see a little bit of stuff. This is coming to the end of my trip. Oh, and uh, it's been a lot it's been a good trip it's been a good trip it's been a long trip so i'm stressful my side's bugging me a bit but it's all part of it you know um answer questions you know I, i'll go on a long trip like this but then i take like time off before this trip i had two months at home i did like maybe maybe two videos that hold two months um so pretty much just take time off so i tell you after this trip i'm gonna take a little bit of time off maybe go on a bit of a vacation per se because let's be honest this trip it was it, as much as fun i get to see a lot of cool sites definitely busy lots of work so uh that's about it y'all thank for this life i've got to i get to have some cool pe uh, meet some cool people have some cool experiences thank you god lord of god and uh that's about it guys so yeah if i find anything else cool tonight i'll show you and if not we'll catch up probably tomorrow hey guess what you rock yes you rock thank you so much for watching the video i totally appreciate it i hope you left me a comment down below i'd love to read them i hope you also liked that video hey by the way click my face you can subscribe yes subscribe that way you always get my uploads you won't miss me when i'm in your town and i also picked two videos for you yes two videos i know you'll love right here so watch one of those hit my face and at that thank you so much you rock